You know, second half, we buckled down a little bit, made some adjustments. I think we just locked in more in the second half, and, and, and it, it really showed. A second half turnaround against the Atlanta Hawks helped propel the Boston Celtics to their eighth straight win. Now the Hawks were up by 10 at halftime, but the Seas came out in the third quarter with an attack mindset as both Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum combined for a total of 55 points and helped fuel the rest of the offense to help them finish with a 105 to 95 victory. We just was a little bit more aggressive, um, got some stops. We came out wanting to start off um, the second half well. Um, we didn't really start the game off well, um, so we wanted to start the second half off well. And, uh, we defensively got some stops and was able to get out and run. We were just cooking. Um, obviously, you know, this game and last game, we felt like we gave up too many points. And then, you know, second half, we buckled down a little bit, made some adjustments. Um, and I think we just locked in more in the second half. And, and, and it, it really showed. We felt we didn't play our best defensive first half. I, offensively, we got in a lot of good looks that didn't fall, but we settled a little bit from the perimeter at times, especially against favorable matchups. And so uh, we talked about it being more aggressive there and attacking for yourself or others. Got downhill better in that quarter, but also guarded at a high level and you know, kind of flipped the game 42-23 in that quarter. Now post-game, Ime Odoka also weighed in on the team's chemistry and he said, hey, we took our lumps early, but winning, it breeds confidence. And he feels that this Celtics group is really gelling together as a team now. He also said we know who we have moving forward, so that'll just help with our consistency during this upcoming stretch.